I made a Vegas Golden Knights and a Green Bay Packers logo. I cut these out on my own, made a stencil, shaved my own hair. So this is all something that I just did on my own. First thing you're gonna do, is then you're gonna sit down and make a pattern. So you're gonna lay down about six or eight pieces of tape, and then you're gonna make your pattern. As you can see there, I made a mistake. I just put another piece of duct tape over the top of it, and I redrew that portion that I wanted to draw. Now that I'm here, I've laid this tape down on a board, and I'm just gonna cut out the pattern. So the parts of the pattern that I'm gonna keep and put onto my hair, which is cut to a size one, will be the areas where there's tape. The parts of the pattern where there is, it's just an empty space, we'll be shaving those down to the scalp. When you peel this off, so this was onto the wood, it's pretty much lost all of its stickum. And now I'm just gonna clean up any spots that I don't like. Peel this up. This one's got an outline to it. There's no stickum here because of the wood. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna peel off that bottom layer of tape so it's sticky again. And it's gonna go around. If you squeeze it with your finger, you're gonna take the stickum off. So what works well is to take like your carpenter's knife and we're gonna peel that off. And then you're gonna wanna stick this somewhere where it won't lose its stickum. And then you're gonna do the same thing to your next pieces here. Next, shaved it down with a one. You've cut this hair, you've shaved it. Um, you're gonna have a bunch of loose hairs. Your hair is gonna be oily. Either wash it to get rid of those loose hairs and get rid of the oils. Or just take some duct tape and you're gonna stick that duct tape into your hair to remove those loose hairs so that the new piece of duct tape will actually stick. So here's one that I just done. I had done a Green Bay Packers one. I am doing a Golden Knights one right now. So I have a clean side open on my head here. Okay, and so I'm coming and I can push up to the tape as well. It works best if you go from the tape and drop down and kind of back into it. And this I got a little closer than I wanted, so it's going to be really tight. These cracks, I got them a lot closer than I wanted. So it's actually quite hard to get in there, so we're gonna hope they turn out okay. Ah! <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna peel this off. It looks like it's coming undone. You there? Mm-hmm. And peel that off. And as you can see here, some of it was kind of, it was hard to get in there. I Like I said, I made that crack just too small. So you gotta make sure that you're not getting too little. So that's what we got. You can go back over this with a one. Here's the cool thing about doing these on your own. If you're in doubt and you're struggling, you can always just shave it off. And you know worse for wear. And I'll finish that up. But that's what happens when you don't like it. It was doing okay. You can see how to work it. You do have to make sure that you have a little bit bigger spaces. I didn't make the spaces big enough. Um, as you can see on the Green Bay logo, that turned out really nice. Um, it was uh, a lot bigger. I didn't leave such small gaps. So the other one had just two small gaps to be working on my own. Um, so make sure if you're cutting your hair that you leave a little bit bigger gaps. Um, I could do it again. I could save that emblem, make sure I get it on there and put it on the right way next time. Um, get a smaller a clipper with a smaller blade. Um, hopefully this helps, gives you some idea, something you can try. And as always, Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.